about it. Other than that, we lost first place the first quarter. A lot of McFeelys love the ball. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. To the family. A lot of fun. Timberlands, Dwayne Dye with the Kuhn family. famous families in bowling, right, gang? That's right. Yep. <laughs> Here in the south side of Chicago, Gino Spells, Mom Pearl, nice seeing you, Pearl. Yes. Hi, everybody. Glad to be back on Channel 25 with uh, yes, Dwayne Dow. Oh, yes. You got it right. It's always yeah. going to be at Halstead Bowl. How many lanes here, Gino? We got 18 lanes here. We got a lot of leagues. Come on in and join up. We're going to have summer leagues this summer, and we're going to have a lot of fun down here at Halstead. We're coming up with new ideas all the time. Summer leagues, fall leagues, all kinds of league action. Men, women, let's not forget the youngsters. That's right. We got kids bowling. My little nephew, he's about five years old. He bowls. He shoots 150, 160. Come on in and bowl up against them. So you have junior league openings. Now when the fall season starts, when do the, the juniors bowl? The juniors, they start about the week after school starts. Terrific. Now yes. occasionally you have parties here too, Pearl, don't you? Yes. Family reunions, church outings, any fundraisers that you would like to have. It's the best fundraiser, the best outing you could have, a bowling party at Halstead Bowl. Right. So come on down. Uh, what's the phone number? 928 8181. And I love the address here on Halstead Street. What is it, Gina? It's 12345. How can you forget that? 12345 <laughs> South Halstead, downtown West Pullman, right, gang? Right. Halstead Bowl League action coming right up. Wentworth Tire Service, 11130 South Corliss, just west of I-94. And they're in Calumet Park at 127th and Ashland. Your headquarters for Firestone, Bridgestone, and General Tires. For cars, vans, and light trucks. Also used tires, all brands. At Wentworth Tire Service, they have ASE trained technicians to do expert tire mounting, balancing, wheel alignment. They also do brakes, shocks, tune-ups, auto heating, and air conditioning. And of course, they have oil changes. All work is guaranteed. Take down the phone number for Wentworth Tire Service. Call 821-4802. They work Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. to 5.30 p.m., Saturday, 7 to 3. During business hours, they do road service for tire repair. Call 821-4802. They accept all major credit cards. Wentworth Tire Service, 11130 South Corliss. That's west of I-94, and they're in Calumet Park at 127th and Ashland. The best tires, Firestone, Bridgestone, General, also used tires. The best in service, Wentworth Tire Service, 11130 South Corliss, just west of I-94. And they're in Calumet Park at 127th and Ashland. Now we're on for Napleton Dodge. Ed Napleton Dodge. Boy, it's one of the outstanding car dealerships in America. Right, Tom Wise? Yes, sir, absolutely. Sales representative for Ed Napleton Dodge. Tom, what's that location? That's at 6550 West 95th Street in Oak Lawn. Just east of Harlem Avenue. Just east of Harlem Avenue on 95th Street. You've been working for general manager uh, Ray Zarnick for quite some time? For eight years I've been with Ray. So you know that book you've got there, the new Dodge book by heart, don't you? Oh, well, pretty much so. Tell me about those great new Dodges. Well, we have an excellent selection of cars, trucks, minivans, full-size vans, and sport utility vehicles to meet your every need. Financing? Financing is available to fit everybody's budget. Come see Tom Wise. See Tom Wise at Ed Napleton Dodge, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ed Napleton Dodge, 6550 West 95th Street. If you want to call Tom, what's the phone number? 708-233-1800, extension 133. I got you, right down to the extension. Okay, used cars, everybody likes them. We have new and used cars to fit everybody's need. Nice selection of used cars, and of course, those Dodges. The new Dodges, come test drive. Great to have Tom Wise and the folks from Ed Napleton Dodge with us. Now we start on, let's see, we're on lanes five and six here at Halstead Bowl. Dwayne Dow and Geno Spells. And we have Gail Hampton from the Garfield and Ashland neighborhood, and she left the five pin on the right lane. 
And that was her second shot. She she didn't throw a good shot on her first shot, so she left nine and swept it away. This is the Mixers League. Yes, four o'clock. They've been with us for a long time right now. They got a good good uh, league. They got all the whole house, 18 lanes. John Geider. He's not a suburban invader, sir, from Markham. Yeah, John's been around for a while. He was on our Thursday leagues. Now he's been on our Saturday league for a few years. And yes, that was a good shot by John. Rolls the ball well. Yeah. He's a competitor. He's got a nice roll there. And now, Donica. Is it Danica or Donica? Donica? Donica Lyles. Yeah, Donica bowls in two leagues up here. She bowls on Tuesday Unique League, and she bowls on the 4 o'clock mix. She just left the mother-in-law shot there. Yeah. The 2 and the 8. She lives around 95th and Ashland. And uh, now we must be in the 10th frame, are we? Yeah, because John's shooting. John, game. number two, this is for a double here in the 10th. Let's see if he can pick it up. He holds it, he really concentrates. Yeah, I think they're in a tight match here and they're trying to overcome this team. And now oh, he's got that to four nine, just a little bit high. Well, the second ball in the 10th is when you should leave that, right? Yeah, that's not a bad place to put it. If I had to leave it, I guess I'd leave it there. And let's point out that Gino Spells, one of the top bowlers on the south side of Chicago for many years. And here's Donica. Hey, that's the way. All right, that's that's the cover net spare. That's the way you cover it. We would call it Mark's womanship, right? Yeah. Mark's <laughs> womanship. Now, with the rail, go for the wood, take one out. All right, and with that nice spare conversion, that gives uh, the lady on the right, Donica Lyles, another shot. See how important those spares are. Oh, yeah, definitely in the 10th frame, you want to try to mark. Everybody's around the screen now, so we know the game is real tight. All right, Donica Lyles on the right lane. Donica rolls Brooklyn, and she picks him up with a 10th frame. All right. You see, she's happy about that, and her team's also happy. Now, here's Charles Lawson. He's a big fellow, the one, two, and the four. For the anchor man, he uh, lives in the Englewood area. He came from across the Dan Ryan. That's permitted to Halstead Bowl. Yeah, Charles has been bowling in this league also for a long time. He's one of the uh, founders, I'd say, of this league. He's been around for a little while. Big fellow, kind of blocks out the pins. <laughs> yeah. He liked to convert this spare, though. Let's see if we can do it. Now, here's Kenny Harris. Uh, or no, that's a Herman Hampton, I believe, in the right yeah, lane. That's Herman, Big Herm. Big Herm, huh? Yeah. All right, he, uh, he lives near Garfield and Ashland. Yeah. And a nice spare conversion for Charles Lawson there. Yeah, they're getting excited around here. He picked a spare up. There's a couple bowlers left in the 10th frame, and we're going to see how this comes out. Very close match, right? Oh, yeah. Folks, who's ahead right now? Yeah, Ellie, we got one more ball. Well, it's very close. Oh, ten all five, the spares, five. all the spares are being converted here. And that was a good one by Herman Hampton. And not Charles Lawson. He'll get that last ball. Every pin counts in a close match. Yeah, definitely so. They got over 1,000 on the right side, and it looks like on the left, they got about 987, so it's a different with about 20 pins here. A little bit less than 20 pins, actually. A couple bowlers left. And there's 10 by Charles. All right. What a way to go out. Strong 10th frames, it seems, for everyone. And uh, this was uh, is Herman Hampton here still on the right lane, right? Right. And this will bring up the anchor man, Kenny Harris, uh, who comes from Hammond, Indiana. Now it comes down to Kenny Harris, and I would think that if he doubles here, uh, that could mean victory for his team, couldn't it? For the Hammers team. Yeah, he needs a double here. Double win the game for his team. Now this is really, a, this is where it comes right down to the clutch shots. Last bowler, 10th frame. Needs a strike here for his team to win. Oh, he could get not it. strike. Got an eight Did count, just a little it. high. We're gonna take a break now for just a second. Now we start game two. And you know something, even though uh, Kenny Harris left that 4-7, he was able to convert it and get count, and his team did win. 10-15 to 10-12 by three pins. The team on the, uh, uh, the Hammers won it, 10-15 to 10-12. How about it, huh? Yeah, they, they had a good game and a good, a good close match. 
The team on the left with Gail Hampton up right now, they win by three pins. So every pin counts and every shot. That's all the time in bowling. Everybody knows that you can, it's all you can get. There's Gail Hampton. She and her husband, Herman, Big Herm, right? That's Big Herm. <laughs> to mention our advertisers, Amco Transmissions, there are a few steps, you know, from Halstead Bowl. 12307 South Halstead. As uh, owner Al Hawkinson is in with us every year, if you, if you think anything's wrong with your transmission, you hear any funny noises, take it in. They'll give it that external diagnostic service, and they can prevent any major problems by checking it as early as they can. Drop in soon. They do excellent work. Amco Transmissions, 12307 South Halstead. On State Recycling, Larry Rushikoff pays top dollar for all metals, copper, brass, aluminum, stainless steel, cast iron. Bring it all in. They pay top dollar in the city of Chicago. On State Recycling, 5807 South State Street. They take up the whole block. On State Recycling, they're open every day. D'Angelo's Pawners and Jewelers, a collateral-owned company. Frank Ingram, the owner. Yolanda Ingram Williams, the manager, Frank's daughter. And they have an outstanding selection of jewelry. They'll also pay cash for, uh, for jewelry, and they will give you an outstanding loan. They are into the pawning business, and you can certainly pawn an item. Just bring it in. Pawn an item at D'Angelo's Pawners and Jewelers, a collateral loan company, Frank Ingram, the owner, 6920 South Stony Island Avenue, also Ingram Jewelers and Pawners, 4234 West Madison, west of Pulaski. Classy lady Janice Turner and Misty's Boutique, two stores, a few doors apart from each other, on 87th Street, just east of Stony Island Avenue. Colorful women's dress clothing, reasonable prices, drop-in, suits, dresses, hats, classy lady, and Misty's Boutique. Carpet Corner, the home of instant credit. Jill Chavin, the owner. Rick Martinez, manager, 4555 South Ashland, back of the yards neighborhood. Outstanding selection of all furniture, including dinettes. Terrific refrigerators. Great terms. 90 days, same as cash. Excellent carpet. Rolls and rolls to choose from. Mohawk, Shaw, and other brands. Remnants start at $10. Carpet corner. La Frutaria. La Frutaria. We love La Frutaria. 8909 South Commercial. Their food comes from everywhere. They specialize in imported foods from Africa, Jamaica, Mexico, and the Caribbean. Also fresh produce brought in every day. Dairy goods to La Fruteria. And Remax Top Performers. Based on 111th Street, west of Western Avenue. Maria C. Cronin, broker owner. And whether you're buying or selling, they guarantee sales. And for buyers, 100% financing available. Maria C. Cronin and her people, they're there every day of the week, seven days. On 111th Street, west of Western Avenue, Remax, Remax, top performers. We'll be back. Medley's moving in self-storage, a giant landmark on 95th Street, east of the Ryan, just west of King Drive. Owner Howard Medley and son Thurman tell me that there are storage spaces available now at Medley's Moving and Self Storage. All sizes to fit your needs, call 821-4000. Medley's is a heated indoor storage facility, clean and secure, with nearly 600 storage lockers. Convenient to all public transportation at 251 East 95th Street, just west of King Drive. Access hours are Monday through Friday, 7 a.m. till 7 p.m. Saturday, 7 till 5. Sunday, by appointment, call 821-4000. Owners Howard Medley and son Thurman. Office manager Stephanie Purnell. And they're licensed movers throughout the Chicago area or cross country. Medley's moving in self-storage. Now, when you move with Medley's, you know it'll be prompt, efficient service. They'll move you across the street or across the country. No job too large or small. For your next move, make it a Medley's move. Call 821-4000 for the finest in indoor storage. Heated, clean, secure. Rely on Medley's in business over 30 years. For fast service in renting of tools and construction equipment, rely on Wirtz Rentals Company, 1045 West 47th Street, just west of Halstead. Also in Summit, 
5707 South Archer Road, west of Harlem. They rent all tools. They rent construction heaters, all types and sizes. Also, sewer rotting equipment. They rent contractors' equipment, including compressors, generators, scaffolding, pumps, scissors lifts, concrete and mortar mixers. As President Bob Wirtz tells me, they rent everything from a hand shovel to a diesel backhoe. For information, phone 247-2443. At Wirtz Rentals Company, they rent cleaning and remodeling equipment, including floor sanders, floor buffers, carpet cleaners. They accept cash, Visa, and MasterCard. A constant backer of our local bowling telecasts, Wirtz Rentals Company is open seven days, Monday through Saturday, 7.30 a.m. to 5 p.m., and Sunday from 10 a.m. till 11.30 a.m. as a convenience to customers. Wirtz Rentals Company, 47th Street, just west of Halstead, and in Summit, 5707 South Archer Road. <laughs> Beggar's Pizza. They really enjoy it here at Halstead Bowl. Beggar's Pizza, right down the street in Blue Island at 127th and Western Avenue. Also, they're in Marionette Park and other locations. Delicious thin crust deep dish or stuffed pizza. Freshest ingredients, Beggar's Pizza. For pickup or delivery, their Blue Island telephone number is 708-385-1234. 708 385 1234. Now, if you wish, dine in. Nice atmosphere, wide selection of beers, wines, and liquors. That beggar's pizza is mouth-watering. It's in demand always, and also on the menu, delicious pasta and sandwiches, beef, chicken, spaghetti, mustacholi. The Garetto brothers, Larry and Pete, welcome you. They're open seven days, including Friday and Saturday till midnight. Beggar's Pizza, where the food and service are excellent. For pickup or delivery, try the Blue Island telephone number, 708-385-1234. Also, they're in Marionette Park at 115th and Kedzie. And they're in Oak Forest, Oak Lawn, Lansing, and Palos Hills. Beggar's Pizza. Gene, uh, Gino, you've got uh, some excellent uh, personnel here. Oh, yeah, these are some of the bowlers in the house that I want to mention and uh, let everybody know and recognize them. Uh, Who's this big fellow right here in the blue? This is actually my brother-in-law, Daryl Moore. Uh, you call he, him a killer? Oh, yeah, he thinks he's a real big killer. He he, he, he bowls pretty good. Uh, he's had a couple big games in here. What was that, 299 or 299? 299, 299 two, and about four or 279 this year. Yeah. What's your average league average? Uh, 211, I think. Have you had that 300 yet? Uh, not yet. On the 299, what pin was left? Four pin. Were you there when he did it? Yeah, he, he was in the pocket, just a little bit high. I, I'll give it to him. I went on the floor just a little bit. <laughs> I was on one and two. <laughs> you were on lanes one and two. Yeah, I'm on it today. Hopefully 300 today. Go get him. All right. Good to see you. My okay. pleasure. What is your name? Come on Shannon. in closer. My name is Shannon. Last name? Southern. Now you have, uh, you know, you're built kind of like Pete Weber, kind of close to the pins, right? How yeah. tall are you? About five, six. And what do you weigh? 130. I bet he's deceiving, though, huh? Yeah, Shannon, uh, he just crossed over. He was one of our top junior bowlers, and now he's joined the league. And uh, last week, he shot 299. You had a 299? Yes. What pair of lanes? One and two also. Shannon, way to go. I know we're going to get that 300 from you pretty soon. I hope so. How old are you? 17. That's all. And the big man. Hello, Wayne. Big how Hank, are you? how are you? I'm still here. What's still your last the last name? Hank Hardy. And when you come to Halstead Bowl, look for Hank at the counter. Right. Still the fixture, and that doesn't mean face bowl or promote either. Look okay. for Hank. Familiar face. We'll be back. All right. Sarabia Auto Parts and Glass, a big facility taking up a whole city block, 1400 West Pershing Road, just east of Ashland. Mario Sarabia and his people open seven days, Monday through Saturday, 9 a.m. till 7 p.m., Sunday, 9 a.m. till 2 p.m. At Sarabia Auto Parts and Glass, they have a huge selection of parts. Whatever you need, low, low prices on tires, axles, bumpers, fenders, front ends, rear ends, motors, transmissions, low, low prices for these late model used auto parts. Now they have the parts. Big yard for information call, 927-6262. Sarabia Auto Parts and Glass, 1400 West Pershing, just east of Ashland. They do outstanding installation of any windshield or door glass. Low cost installation. They're always looking to buy junk cars. They pay cash on the spot. 
Mario Sarabi and his people will find the auto part you need. Call 927-6262, open seven days. Sarabia, auto parts and glass, 1400 West Pershing, east of Ashland. Now we're with Fanny Lipscomb. She runs One Stop Insurance Agency here in Midlothian on 147th Street, just west of Pulaski Road. Fanny, you and your son Robert have joined us. You've got all the insurance needs for all of our people covered. I know that. Yes, we do. And let me ask you about your coverages. What do you cover? We cover a commercial, auto, homeowners, business, life, all your insurance needs. And Fanny, what if people are having difficulty getting their car insurance? Can you help them? Will you be insured if you come to One Stop? Yes, you will. We have finance responsibility. All you have to do is come. We're, we're insure you. So you'll find a plan for them. Now, how long have you been here? How many years? We've been here 15 years. Do you have anything else to add for our viewers? Yes, I do. Hey there, all you guys and dolls running around trying to beat the odds. Auto insurance is here to stay. So step on up to One Stop and see how little you pay. Mr. Do-Right ain't playing, and that's a fact. So why should you get caught holding the sack? Call 385-4404. We're never too busy for you, and that's for sure. One Stop Insurance Agency, 147th Street, just west of Pulaski Road. All right, let the last time down come through here. Here we go with uh, <laughs> lanes 11 and 12 as we move up the house at Halstead Bowl. One, two, three, four, five, South Halstead. That's right. Come on down. We got summer leagues. Got everything going on down here at Halstead Bowl. Have a great time. Look into the fall leagues. You've got those signing up all the time. And if you want to have your party, it's a great place to have it here at Halstead Bowl. Here is a man in overalls, Al Willis of Griffith, Indiana, a Hoosier. How about that? Yeah, that's a double, Al. He's the anchor man on this team. This is James Tapp in the left lane, I believe. Yeah. Wearing the Nike shirt. Yeah. Now, the Nike should be paying him to wear that shirt, right? Yeah, definitely. He's not too happy with that 710 split he just got. Okay, James Tapp on the left lane. And he's got a rail. Seven and the ten. And on the right lane, Fred Hawk Hampton. And we have another 710. Look at that. We have a 710 on the left lane and a 710 on the right lane. That is an oddity. Let's get a shot of that, Paul. 710 on both lanes. And we see things in this series no one was ever seen before in bowling. 710 on lane 11. 710 on lane 12. And the odds against this one of these being picked up are astronomical. Oh, there's a what they call a field goal there. Yeah, that's definitely a field goal there. We got a guy on the left lane. I'm betting he gets one of them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now the lady in red is coming up on the right lane, and now we're going to see what the what uh, James Tapp does with his 710. At least maybe pick up uh, the seven or the ten. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, he's going for the seven, and he's gonna go right through the middle also. <laughs> no wood at all. Nothing. <laughs> well, at least they left those two, which was... Okay, we have Kathy Jenkins of Calumet City leaving the six, nine, and the ten. Number two woman for the Timbers team. And Kelly Sullivan from Sauk Village. Looking good. Nice follow. -through. Nice roll. Oh, she leaves the ten pin. What a tap. It's all good against the Timbers. And uh, Kathy Jenkins bowling for the Timbers on the right lane. Kelly Sullivan's team in the left lane. One game, one nine, 57 to 884. They have 22 more handicap pins, which did not really come into play in that game. Action up and down the house here, Gina. Oh, yeah, I'm looking at Kathy now. She's probably going to get this spare. She wants a little revenge, she said, from the first game. Oh, but she misses it. She's not going to get it like that. Hey, we'll take any kind of a spare here, folks. Any kind of a spare, won't we? Yeah, come on. Let's get it on. Now, maybe Kelly Sullivan can convert this 10-pin. Let's see some Mark's womanship here. All right, Kelly doesn't like this 10, but she's got it this time. All right. 
Carol Williams from 97th and Ashland. Hey, now we're getting better. Ooh, there's another 10 pin. The Timbers against It's All Good. Men's and Women's League bowling every Thursday night at 9 o'clock, Friday night at 6 o'clock. Channel 25 cable in the city of Chicago. Channel 25 cable. The woman with the hair is Jerry Jones from the Brainerd neighborhood, 84th and Ashland. Oh, some little bitty steps coming in. One, two, three, four. <laughs> there they are. All right, Jerry. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, that's 10. Those little steps seem to work for. <laughs> We're going to see a lot of big men doing those little steps now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now, come on, Carol. Carol Williams, 95th and Ashland. Let's have another nice conversion of that 10 pin. Yeah, the 10 pin is always a hard pin for a lot of right handed bowlers. And as you can see, she just had a tough time with it, too. Now here's Bill Neal from Jeffrey Manor. Lives near Jeffrey and 100th Street. Big, tall fellow. Yeah, let's see what Neil has for us. Tall and slim. Whoa! What a flourish. <laughs> oh, he's a left-handed guy. With the red ball. Yes. Nice shot. Oh. What a style. Now here's James Lee from 99th and Halstead. The man from Washington Heights, sir. Yeah, James has been around in this league for a long time also here. The man from Washington Heights is outside the pocket. Got pretty good pin count there. Yeah. He got eight. He's a pretty good bowler. Hey, Gino Spells, uh, you're a darn good bowler. Uh, what's been your best series ever? Uh, best series, I think I had 785, something like that. Seven. Pins away from the Charm Circle 800. Yeah, nice. I was hot that night. Nice conversion there by Bill Neal. Okay, we're doing good here. And the man in the stripes. James Lee is open. We're having fun. Halstead Bowl. We'll be back. The boys of Leo High School learn the best in industrial trades from the Hinton's Industrial Arts School. Jim Hinton, owner of Central Heating and Cooling, the founder of the school. Jim, this is an auspicious occasion during our telecast. You have an announcement to make regarding Hinton's Industrial Arts School. Thanks, Wayne. Yes, it is. We are expanding our school this year. We have 25 students now. Next year, we're going to have 35 and a new building. No kidding. A brand new building for the youngsters. Brand new building. This is going on forever. Let's talk to a few of the dignitaries who've shown up, shall we? Shouldn't have. Let's do it. Alderman Leonard DeVille, 21st Ward. What a job Mr. Hinnon has done with Hinnon Industrial Arts School. Well, he's done a wonderful job. This is something that he started a couple of years ago. We started talking about reaching out to some of our young people to show them that there was a better way than just dropping out of school and some that didn't want to go to college. And Mr. Hinton took upon himself after we discussed the issues and uh, decided that he wanted to train them his skill. And this is where we're asking businessmen all in our community to reach out and pick up some of our young people and uh, train them. Wonderful, Alderman DeVille. Nice having you with us. Steve Sims, President, Northern Trust Bank, past president, Southside. Uh, Rotary, and you have something to say to the youngsters today. Well, I'd like to applaud all the young folks, and I'd like to applaud Mr. Hinton. Obviously, this is something that we're very committed to, and uh, we'd like for all of them to continue that good work. And, uh, Jim, I'd like to say congratulations to you on an outstanding program, and we're behind you all the way. Wonderful to have you here, Steve. Let's talk to one of the youngsters. What's your name? Uh, Patrick Benfield. Patrick, what do you have to say about the school? Uh, well, I just think uh, Mr. Hinton is putting together a beautiful program for the students. This experience most students don't have to come over and be able to learn about heating and cooling, something that uh, is a very good business to get into, and it's an experience that is very rare. And I, I just think it's great that we can come over there and learn something like this in the community. You're a fine young spokesman. Jim, come back in here for a minute. Jim Hennon, congratulations to you. Let's hope this school goes on for years. You could use some contributions. For people who like to contribute, what do they do? Oh, just right 940 West 79th Street, it's Hinton Industrial Arts, and we'll be more than happy. Okay, it's on the screen. Hinton's Industrial Arts School, the address again. 940 West 79th Street. And what's the telephone number? 488-7731. That's an area code 773. The boys of Leo High School learn the best in industrial trades from the Hinton's Industrial Arts School. Jim Hinton, owner of Central Heating and Cooling, the founder of the school. 940 West 79th Street. 
And what's the telephone number? 488-7731. That's an Avery code 773. Thank you. Rich Johnson owner, Bill Opelka manager. Johnson Lumber Company in Palos Park. Rich, good having you with us good again, Good to see sir. you, Dwayne. Always a pleasure. The location for Johnson Lumber Company? 123rd and 82nd Avenue in Palos Park. And I know this, you're west of Harlem Avenue. Just keep driving yes. to the beautiful countryside. Oh, it's beautiful. Indeed. Surrounded by forest preserves, it's well worth the trip. Indeed. And the products at Johnson Lumber Company make it well worth the trip. This time of the year, oh, moldings, doors, floors, Doors, Thermatrue for exterior, interior doors and cherry, oak, molded masonite, ponderosa pine, radiata pine, hemlock, six panel, four panel, cathedral style, a vast variety of possibilities. You got a nice showroom there too. Lovely showroom, always welcome to the public. Terrific. And Bill, what about uh, lumber, my friend? Hey, the lumber at Johnson Lumber, our red oak and now white oak in stock, rare and hard to find. Come and get it. It's all 120 grit sanded S4S, poplar, cherry, mahogany, everything you need for your home. Turn that wood into a custom mantle or other fine furniture here at the Custom Mill Shop at Johnson Lumber Company. Well said. Lots of mill work. And what about those Ryder trucks? Well, if you're sick of your home and you want to move, give us a call because we've got 10s, 15s, 20s, and 24s, and we'll get you on the road right away. All right. <laughs> Ryder truck rental with windows and doors, millwork, Johnson Lumber Company in Palos Park. Thank you. Thank you. Now we're joined by Darnell Estes from Marquette National Bank. Darnell, nice seeing you. Nice seeing you. Marquette National Bank, President George Moncada. He's been a constant backer of our telecast over the years. What's that location? 63rd Western. Yeah, easy to find. Now, you're from the south side. Where were you brought up? On 63rd and Blackstone. So this is the man who can help you with your mortgages. And certainly, I know this, that people right now have a good time to refinance. Yes, it is. For debt consolidation, lower your interest rate and lower that payment. The rates are still low. Yes, they are. The people to contact are Marquette National Bank. At 708-349-0770. Uh, Let's point out that is a 708 telephone number. Give it to me one more time. 708-349-0770. You work closely with Mike Mangan, and I understand the mortgage services are better than ever at Marquette National Bank. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. Okay. Now, I just consolidate my debts. I can make sure that I'm financed to get... And it maybe free up some extra money? That's correct. You can do uh, debt consolidation. You can do home improvements. Okay. okay. And let's get those mortgages and make sure that the right people are there with the right service and the right people. Darnell Estes Darnell and his... Estes. Uh, my name is Darnell Estes. My Marquette number is... Marquette National Bank. At 708-349-0770. Remember Darnell. He's from the south side. He'll serve you. You know it. Thank you. Well, here we are next to the... Uh, the brick post here. You've got brick post throughout Halstead Bowl. Nice atmosphere. Yeah, you don't want to bump your head up against this. It's been around here. We've been here for 22 years, and I think it's been here a little bit longer than that. Well, after <laughs> a, a tough game, a bowler may want to knock his head against that brick post. Yeah, some people get mad. You know, they shoot a bad game. They can't win no money. You know how it goes. You know who you are. <laughs> We're on the bricks right here at Halstead Bowl. We want to talk about this fellow on the left. Oh, T. Ray. This is the infamous T. Ray. He's been around here for a little while. He's a very great, a very good bowler, I should say. Uh, he shot 300 one week in the league and come back the next week and shoot 300 again. I think he started getting banned out the pots almost after that. <laughs> <laughs> What's your full name? Tuan Ray. Tuan? Yeah. How old are you? Too old. <laughs> Two 300s. One series after the other series. Yeah. What an experience. Well, just fought it again. Tell me about that experience. Well, you get what you put into it. You practice and dedicate yourself, then you get what you put into it. How many games a week do you bowl? Um, probably about 60 now. How many? 60. If everybody bowled 60 games, boy, this game would be flourishing. We'd have it backed up all the way to Calumet City trying to get in there. Oh, yeah. We need everybody bowling 60 games like T. Ray over here. That's right. Come on, nice down. going, T. Ray. Come all on right, in here now. Lot. What is your name? Carolyn Bang. Carolyn, you are? Roger Connor. Okay. How's your bowling, Carolyn? My bowling is getting better. <laughs> How about you? Compared to me, up to my standards, it's excellent. <laughs> we'll be back. All right. Okay, Let's go. Okay.
Now we're on for one of the industry leaders in the area. RPS Hydraulics Sales and Service in Riverdale, 902 West 134th Street, just west of Halstead. Rocky Orlandi and his people. Over 25 years in business, RPS Hydraulics, experts in remanufacturing cylinders, valves, and pumps. And they also make new pumps and power steering cylinders, serving industries throughout the United States with the finest in materials and workmanship. They serve the steel industry, the material handling and waste industries. All hydraulic work is done on the premises, turning out pumps in large or small quantities, and they can make one or a thousand. So many companies have relied on RPS hydraulics over the years for their hydraulic cylinders, pumps, and valves. Good to have RPS Hydraulics with us again on our telecast of Local League Bowling. They're based in Riverdale, 902 West 134th Street, just west of Halstead. They're also in Griffith, Indiana, and in Pompano Beach, Florida. Rocky Orlandi and his people, RPS Hydraulics Sales and Service. Back with us. Tom O'Brien representing Sweet Baby Ray's Gourmet Sauces. Tom, just talking about Sweet Baby Ray's makes me hungry. It's good stuff, and we really appreciate that, Dwayne. Uh, we've been a product here in Chicago for many years. We've done very well here and uh, very successful. Pick it up anywhere at your local grocers, and it's a great product. You need to try it. Indeed. We have the original and we have the hot and spicy, right? Correct. We have both flavors now uh, stocked just about everywhere throughout Chicagoland. Pick it up in any quantity. Look for Sweet Baby Ray's at food stores everywhere. That's that special recipe you have, right? Oh, yeah, that special recipe that the owner came up with himself, a secret family recipe that he, he's got himself. Now, you've got uh, the other O'Brien, Mike. What relation is he to you? My brother. All right, brother Mike O'Brien right. and Sweet Baby Ray himself. Who would that be? Dave Raymond. Who shed about 50, 60 pounds? Uh, I think it's closer to 100 these days. What a terrific job he's done. He was a big man. Now he's a smaller man, but he still represents the finest barbecue sauce in America, right? He sure does, and I'm very happy for him. It's a, it's a great product. Great product, Sweet Baby Ray's. The sauce is the boss. You got it, Dwayne. Look for it at food stores everywhere. Fastest growing barbecue sauce in America. Three years running. I love that. Thanks, Tom O'Brien. Thank you, Dwayne. We appreciate it. Up on the blue wall at Halstead Bowl, lanes 17 and 18, as we were walking up here to cover this pair of lanes, I mentioned to you that not many centers in the country have 18 lanes, that's kind of a different number. Right, 18 was, is, is a unique number for us. Uh, not too many bowling alleys in the city. Actually, I don't think anybody has 18 lanes other than Sometimes us. Sometimes you wish you had four times 18, all the people want to bowl here at Halstead Bowl. Right, because if we could fit them all in here, we'd fit them all in here. But come on and let's keep the, keep the 18 lanes going in here as much as possible. Hey, Dad can't be with us tonight? Uh, he was here late last night, so I told him I'd be here tonight to give him a little rest, that's all. Gene Spells, the patriarch of the Spells family. Family. Yes, he's the hard worker here. Okay, now we got the Thunder team. This is the first place team. They've already clinched the championship. And uh, on the right lane, Johnny Mays. Johnny Mays, right? Right, they call him the big dog in here. And this is what first place is all about. I mean, you know, you bowl all season. This is the last week they're bowling. And you want to come in first place. This is the goal of all league members, to come into first place. Sabrina Huey lives near 87th and Stony Island. Nice shot by Sabrina Huey. Yeah, that was a nice shot. Sabrina has a good ball. She's been bowling in this league for a couple years. Roosevelt Clayton from the Gresham neighborhood. Oh! Oh, he gets the trip! Of the four pin, I mean the six pin, excuse me. We'll take the trip anytime. Oh, yeah. Wait, and go. Michael Fryer. There you go. Man, they're just striking like mad down here. This is first and second place going against each other, but this is where you're going to see all your strikes. Now, the team in the left lane right now, the high rollers, they defeated the Thunder 937 to 924 in game one. So you've got. The high rollers are motivated. They would like to uh, sweep the league champions. That's what they want to do. Yeah, you know, you just always want to let let them know, you know, if we had a few more weeks, we'd probably be, you know. I don't think the Thunder's going to go down too easy, though, are they? Oh, oh no. <laughs> Fighting words? Yeah, looks like to be. Okay. And this is Angelo Ware up uh, on lane 17. This is my cousin. Oh, hit that. And Yes, he's showing you what we do in, the, in my family. <laughs> the man from the Englewood neighborhood near 80th and Ashland, Angelo Ware, anchorman for the High Rollers. And here is uh, Jerome Benton 
from near Western and 79th, the Ashburn neighborhood. Southwest Sider. Yeah, Jerome's a good bowler. Actually, earlier this year, Jerome shot 300 here. They find their way to Halstead Bowl from all over the city of Chicago, all over the south side. Got a couple north siders down here, too. Oh, oh yeah. Boy, can he turn it. Oh, yeah, he's got a lot of turn on the ball. Like I said, he shot 300 earlier this year. And uh, matter of fact, uh, we've had a lot of 300 shot in the past couple of years. So we want to get people down here and let them know, you know, we, get, we got high scores coming out of here. The man with a scholarly look in the glasses, Robert Hunt from Riverdale. Yeah, Rob's got a nice ball. He's a left-handed bowler, too. He's been in this league for a while. I'm going to mention our advertisers, Dwayne Dow and Gene Spells. Gino Spells. Halstead Bowl, seat of action tonight. Wentworth Tire Service, 11130 South Corliss, just west of I-94. And their companion uh, store at 127th and Ashland, featuring the Firestone, Bridgestone, new and used tires, general tires. They do great mounting, balancing, and all general car repair at Wentworth Tire Service. Ed Napleton Dodge. Salesman Tom Wise was here. They're in Oak Lawn on 95th Street, just east of Harlem. Ray Zarnick, president and general manager, come test drive the new 98s at Ed Napleton Dodge. Wide selection of used cars, too. You will be financed. Oh, those new Dodges are terrific. Come on in to Ed Napleton Dodge. Medley's moving in self-storage, Howard Medley and son Thurman. Office manager Stephanie Purnell. They're on 95th Street, just west of King Drive. They have all kinds of storage spaces. 600 spaces in a facility that is heated, indoors, safe. They also do the best moving. Outstanding movers. They'll move you across town or cross country. Medley's moving and self storage. Johnson Lumber Company on 123rd Street, west of Harlem in Palos Park. Rich Johnson, the owner, wife Pam. Wonderful people, drop in to see them. You got the name brands, windows, doors, moldings, fireplace mantles. You've got it. They do treated lumber, all kinds of lumber, cedar, redwood, and they rent those rider trucks. Johnson Lumber Company in Palos Park. Yeah, Captain Bay is showing out, eh? Oh, they love the beggar's the pizza. They love the beggar's pizza here at Halstead Bowl. Oh, yeah. Beggar's pizza in Blue Island, 127th and Western Avenue. And they're in Marionette Park on 115th and Kedzie. Beggar's pizza, delicious. They also have the great pasta, beef, chicken, spaghetti. They've got that delicious mostacholi. That beggar's pizza is thin crust, deep dish, or stuffed. Call ahead for takeout or delivery, 708-385-1234, Beggar's Pizza. Sarabia Auto Parts and Glass. Mario Sarabia and his people, 1400 West Pershing Road, just east of Ashland. Wide selection of used auto parts. They do outstanding installation of glass, any windshield or door glass. And they've got thousands of used parts, all low priced. They'll have the part that you need at Sarabia Auto Parts and Glass. And the left-hander, who is that on the left side? That's Roosevelt there, Roosevelt Clayton. Roosevelt Clayton. Yeah, he has a nice ball. We're seeing some strike making. We'll be back after this. Now we're on for REMAX Top Performers. Maria C. Cronin, broker owner, with us again, located right here in the southwest side. Maria, what's that location for REMAX Top Performers? 2758 West 111th Street, just west of Western Avenue on 111th Street. Yeah, the Beverly Mont Greenwood area, but you serve a big area throughout uh, the city of Chicago. Now, tell me about your services. You've got some interesting programs. We have two specialized programs, one for our sellers, and that's our guaranteed sale program. And for our buyers, we can offer 100% financing through one of our lenders. Guaranteed sales. So if my house is up with you for sale, you're going to sell it. Yes, definitely. Most definitely we will sell it. And the 100%, that's pretty good for the buyers. Terrific. Yes, yes it's a great program for people that are uh, well qualified but don't have the funds available just yet. I know they always greet you with a smile at REMAX Top Performers. Yes, we do. Hey, you, you brought some of your staff members Yes, here. I have, and I'd love for you to meet them. Well, I'd love to meet them. Now, what is your name? My name is Don LaSera. And I am a, glad to be a REMAX top performer. Indeed. And you, sir? Bob Stoltz with REMAX. Nice seeing you, Bob. And, and my name is Nando Bruno from REMAX top performers. Some of the friendly faces and people who really know the business. Yes, Isn't that right, Maria? That's right, Dwayne. Thank you very much. REMAX top performers. 
Fruiteria in South Chicago, 8909 South Commercial Avenue, specializing in imported foods from Africa, Jamaica, Mexico, and the Caribbean islands. The store has been in the same location for 40 years. A unique selection of meats, including fresh goat meat, available in shoulders, legs, ribs, any cut you want, expert butchers. Also oxtail, delicious hard chicken, lots of great meats, Low prices on fresh produce. They have vegetables, apples, oranges, also breadfruit from Jamaica. Visit La Fruteria for lunch or dinner. They have tacos, burritos, tortas. Try the gordita. Boy, is it good. It comes with steak, pork, or chicken, and with cheese, lettuce, and tomato. The gordita is at La Fruteria, 8909 South Commercial. And they have the most delicious orange juice from freshly squeezed Florida oranges. La Fruteria opens seven days, Monday through Saturday, 7 a.m. to 9 p.m., Sunday, 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. Look for the black canopy out front. Carpet Corner, the home of Instant Credit, 4555 South Ashland, in the back of the Yards neighborhood. Owner Jill Chavin, manager Rick Martinez, salesman Angel Martin, and a friendly staff to help you find the best in furniture. They have bedding, dinettes, three-piece living room sets, including sofas, love seats, and chairs, cocktail tables, lamps, bedroom sets. Same day delivery available. Mention the TV commercial and receive free delivery. Carpet Corner has lots of appliances, including refrigerators by Frigidaire and GE. Also washers, dryers, freezers, carpeting, hundreds of rolls from which to choose. Mohawk, Shaw, and other brands. Rolls and rolls of terrific carpet. Come in, bring your friends. Pick out what you need. They deliver and install. Also, remnants starting at $10. Easy financing. 90 days, same as cash. No money down with good credit. Carpet Corner, 4555 South Ashland, the back of the yards. Call 927-9500. They're open seven days, including Monday, Thursday, and Friday nights till 7. Gino spells what would Halstead Bowl be without the youngsters? There are always plenty of boys and girls at Halstead Bowl. Oh, yeah, we keep the kids busy, and, uh, you know, it's always something to do. All ages here at Halstead Bowl, come on down and bowl. And it's very healthy to hear the sound of bowling pins and the, the, the camaraderie. It's good for youngsters. It definitely keeps them out of trouble and gives them something to do, something to look forward to. Uh, when you start at a young age, you can improve. It gives you a lot of time to bowl. I started when I was 10 years old. I love it. Hey. Look at the camera. Now, what is your name? Louise. What's your last name? Walls. And what's your name? Sheena. You Sheena. both bowl? No, I'm about to bowl with my mama later. Your hair is real pretty. Thank you. What grade are you in? Third. And what grade are you in? First. Okay, thanks, kids. Oh, great. What's your name? Ed Henderson. Ed, nice seeing you are? Rory Woody. Rory, how you doing? How's the game tonight? Fine. We won the first game so far. Well, you're happy. You're, you're like yeah, the wind, don't you? That's right. <laughs> really. Ed, like how long have you been bowling? Since 93. Okay. Any memorable, any big series? I done had a 254. I like that. How about your best game ever? Uh, the best game so far is about a 240. Okay, we're coming up there, and uh, Allstead Bowl, nice friendly gathering place. Right. 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 Two outlook. That's the team I'm on. Like Especially it. Lightning. The lightning team. That's right. right. The pins go down, hopefully, man. Hopefully. <laughs> we'll be back. Okay. Right. Thank, Thank you. you. Always nice to be with the first lady of fashion on the south side of Chicago. Janice Turner from Classy Lady. We're here at her store on 87th Street, just east of Stony Island Avenue. Janice, I'm always dazzled with the colors when I walk in. We have clothing for everyone. We have hats. We have uh, after five. We have attire for the wedding. Uh, we have jewelry. Whatever hats. your mind can conjure up, you walk into Classy Lady and you'll look at something and say, hey, that's for my lady right there. That's right. And we have all sizes also. Indeed. And all the colors and all the styles and some very sexy wear. That's for sure. That's something for everyone. Now, two doors further east is Ms. T's Boutique. We have Ms. T right here, Janice Turner. How about Ms. T's Boutique? Okay, in Ms. T's we have shoes. That's casual and dress. And we have outfits for the full-figured woman and the young figure. Mm-hmm. Yes, lots of casual attire and always friendly service and people to help you if you're not sure of exactly what you want. That's our motto. 
Both stores located on 87th Street, east of Stony Island Avenue. Classy Lady and Ms. T's Boutique. See the first lady of fashion, Janice Turner. D'Angelo's Pawners and Jewelers, 6920 South Stony Island Avenue. Ingram Jewelers and Pawners, 4234 West Madison, three blocks west of Pulaski. Owner Frank Ingram. The managers, his daughters, Yolanda Ingram Williams, Priscilla Ingram Shoemaker. 14 karat gold and chains, rings, necklaces, charms. They have a great layaway plan. Go into D'Angelo's or Ingram. Also, they have available TVs, VCRs, stereos, drums, guitars, in all price ranges. And you can bring your item in to pawn for instant cash. Now, they'll accept all items, appliances, cameras, any musical instruments, any jewelry, and they'll give you a percentage of the value of the item. It's instant cash. And you can pick that other item up very quickly. D'Angelo's, Pawners and Jewelers, 6920 South Stony Island Avenue. Ingram Jewelers and Pawners, 4234 West Madison, three blocks west of Pulaski. Frank Ingram and his people have a terrific selection of jewelry, musical instruments, TVs, VCRs, and by all means, if you have that item to pawn, they'll pay you the instant cash. It's a great way to go. D'Angelo's on the south side, Ingram on the west side. Good to have them with us. Lanes three and four. We go down to the low end of the house. Sheila Branch, a nice shot. Lives near 131st and stayed in the Pullman neighborhood. Curtis Monaghan, he and his wife are bowling. Number two man for the Wild Bunch and the four and the eight. He lives near 92nd in Vincennes in Brannon Park. That's a new one on me. Yeah, Brannon Park. They have uh, been bowling here for a little while. They were on a Thursday league here a while ago, and now they're bowling on Saturday afternoon. We are taping on a Saturday. We, hope we, uh, we know you watch every Thursday night at 9 o'clock, Friday night at 6. Ed Carthan from Sheldon Heights. I'm learning some new neighborhoods here. Yep. 106th <laughs> and Morgan. They call him Big Ed. Nice shot there. All right, Curtis Monaghan dancing and running out the spare. Yep, next we have Shannon coming up on the right lane on lane four. Last game, Shannon just shot 279. Slim build from the Chatham neighborhood near 88th and Cottage Grove Avenue. Shannon Southern. A lot of turn on the ball and oh, he's a little high. No yeah. shit there. Shannon just uh, crossed over from our junior leagues. He's bowling in the adult leagues now. He's, he's going to be a real good bowler. Another one of the hot young bowlers coming out of the junior league program at Halstead Bowler. Oh, yeah. We're going to produce a pro one of these days coming out of here. RPS Hydraulics, sales and service in Riverdale on 134th Street west of Halstead. They remanufacture hydraulic cylinders, pumps, and valves. They service companies throughout the United States. Rocky Orlandi and his people. Outstanding workmanship. They are terrific professionals at what they do. RPS Hydraulics, sales and service. Sweet Baby Ray's Gourmet Sauces. The sauce is the boss. The fastest growing barbecue sauce in the country. Three years in a row. They're based in Schiller Park. Mike O'Brien, Dave Raymond, pick up Sweet Baby Ray's Gourmet Sauces. Either the uh, standard, that's the original, or the hot and spicy with that special zesty flavor. When you, when you have that, uh, that barbecue, be sure the barbecue sauce is Sweet Baby Ray's. Original barbecue sauce or Sweet Baby Ray's. Hot and spicy. One-stop insurance agency, Fanny Lipscomb, in Midlothian at 4042 West 147th Street, just west of Pulaski. Phone 708-385-4404. You will be insured. No one is turned down. Lowest rates in Chicago for auto insurance. She also has commercial health and medical supplement. Life and low, low rates. 16 years in business. One-stop insurance agency, phone 708-385-4404. Fanny Lipscomb and her people. Jim Hinton, Hinton's Industrial Arts School, 
Jim has done a wonderful job, the owner of Central Heating and Cooling, in, uh, in teaching the youngsters of Leo High School the industrial arts. And he's used the services of people who know what they're talking about in teaching these youngsters so they can go on from Leo High School and have a meaningful career and make some money. In the summertime, they work, and Jim Hinton's Industrial Arts School actually pays them for their labor. Many years they're going to be at it now. I believe they've just completed year number four. What a way to learn. Hinton's Industrial Arts School, 79th Street, west of Halstead, across from Leo High School. Wirtz Reynolds Company, 47th Street, west of Halstead. They rent construction equipment and supplies, many items, excellent terms. Also in Summit, 5707 Archer Road, west of Harlem. Bob Wirtz and his people, constant backers of our telecast, Wirtz Reynolds Company. Marquette National Bank, Darnell Estes was here representing their mortgage department. He and Vice President of Mortgages, Mike Mangan, they all have the, they have the experience to help you with your mortgages. The rates are low. They'll help you consolidate your debts, free up some money for you. They will get that mortgage you need. They're a landmark at 63rd and Western. The mortgage number is 708-349-0770, Marquette National Bank. We're going to meet some more people at Halstead Bowl back after this. On State Recycling, 5825 South State Street, where they pay cash for all metals, paper products, and used auto parts. Bring in copper, brass, any aluminum, stainless steel, scrap gold. Right now, there's a special on cast iron. They pay $80 per ton for any cast iron, including radiators, bathtubs, sinks, old boilers. Bring in used auto parts, alternators, starters, transmissions, motor blocks. They pay cash on the spot at On State Recycling, 5825 South State Street. Now, they're open seven days, starting at 8 o'clock in the morning, Monday through Friday, till 5 p.m., Saturday till 2, and Sunday till noon. Call 667-8283. All metals and paper are recycled to help the environment. Owner Larry Reshikoff also is a collector. He's looking for old coins, vintage paper money, old train sets. Always they pay cash on the spot. On State Recycling, 5825 South State Street. On State Recycling. If your car has noises, leaks, or any performing problems, take it to Amco Transmissions, 12307 South Halstead, just a few steps from Halstead Bowl. Let Al Hawkinson and his people put it through their external diagnostic service. They'll completely check out the car and let you know what needs to be done to prevent any further damage. Over half the cars serviced at Amco do not need major repairs. You'll be told of the needed repairs and the approximate cost before any work is done. Now, take your car to Amco Transmissions, 12307 South Halstead, here in the West Pullman neighborhood. Call 568-4747. Owner Al Hawkinson, manager Ray Vinicky, and their people have years of experience. If you need repairs, they have the highest quality parts and the finest in workmanship, and they provide the Amco worldwide warranty on all rebuilding and repairs. Double AMCO, Amco Transmissions, 12307 South Halstead. They work Monday through Friday, 8 to 5, Saturday, 8 till noon. They accept all major credit cards. Be safe. If you even have a hint of any problem, Bring your vehicle in for their external diagnostic service, Amco Transmissions, 12307 South Halstead. Gene Spells, who do you want to say hello to who? Oh, I got to say hello to my lovely wife and my kids. I love you. I wish you could be here with me, but I know you're at home with the kids. They're often at Halstead, boys. Oh, yeah, they're often up and here. Dad, Gene, uh, he couldn't be with us. He worked long and hard last night. Oh, yeah, my father was here late last night. I also say I love him, too, and uh, I'll be here tonight, so you don't have to worry about it. <laughs> All right, Gene, you know, let's talk to a few more of the bullets. Stay okay. with me now. Stay with me. Okay. You are? Louis Duhart. Okay, where do you live? What area? Uh, south side. All I am a bowler here at Halstead Ball. Uh, maybe about 10 years. Lewis, nice to see you. Big, strong fellow. Yeah. All right, nice talking to you. Come on over with me now. What is your name? Edna. Last name? Carthan. Oh, you're bowling. Oh, yes, your husband and you were bowling. Yeah. <laughs> My son that was bowling. The man in gray. No, and, Lo and the guy you interviewed earlier, Shannon. How you doing? It's my right. son, okay. And Shannon's a good, nice young fellow. Yeah. Yep. Families bowl together, stay together. That's right. We love it. Come on in. <laughs> and you are? I'm Martha Edmund. Come on in. That's Tuffy. Nice seeing you. What's your name? Tamaru. 
Last name? Gomez from Southside. Lo lovely women. Come on in, Gino. Of Halstead Bowl, Dwayne Dow, Gino Spells, and Zay Clayton. We'll see you next time from Halstead right. Bowl. Bye. Take care. Bye.